Hi, hope you're having an amazing day. As a supplement out of this video, today we're gonna be doing a drugstore makeup haul. Basically, we have a haul from Dollar Tree, from ColourPop, as well as Shamus A. So if you wanna see what I picked up from those three shops, definitely keep on watching. Before that, don't forget, if you like drugstore makeup, go ahead and stick around, subscribe, maybe hit the bell so you're notified whenever I upload. And if you can like the video, if you like it, and the video's gonna start right now. Before we get into the drugstore haul, I definitely want to shout out Dazi A. So if you guys have heard of Dazi A, it's basically a luxury fragrance line without paying the big bucks or a lot of money for it. It's very inexpensive. This bottle here in Florental Coconut retails for $29. The aesthetic of this bottle is everything. The way it can package is everything. It does come with its own little card. Talking about all the notes on it, inspiration of this perfume, the concentration of this perfume. It's so cool. Also, the really cool thing about Dazier in general, what I found really interesting is that when you purchase this 50 milliliter bottle, let's say, you purchase this, it also comes with a little sample size that you can try out for a week or so to see if the fragrance is something you're looking for, is it something you like, is it not something you like, just so you can kind of get a sense of the product without opening the actual big bottle. And if, let's say you don't like it, you can exchange it for a full refund within the 30 day mark, which I thought was really cool a lot of brands don't really do that so i found that really interesting and they also do offer exchanges and free returns if that's something that you're looking for and also free shipping if you purchase three plus bottles which i think is amazing another thing i like to mention about this brand in general is that the aesthetic of their like bottles is everything they're really heavy weighted really nice they have a magnetic kind of closure to them which is really cool and it's like you're getting the luxury experience without spending that extra coin a lot of brands high-end brand of fragrances retail for $300 $100 and 150 for one bottle whereas these literally this Florento coconut retails for $29 this one in aquatic peony retails for $39 you're not breaking the bank to smell good is what I'm saying and these are very long-lasting I've been trying them out for a couple weeks now and they're just so nice they smell so good they go really well with the chemistry of like my skin and they're just so nice you can definitely layer them as well so let's talk about the fragrances individually first one is in florento coconut which is inspired by tom ford soleil blanc et de perfume put the notes on the screen and basically all of them are also listed on the actual bottle so nice look at this situation so beautiful so it just feels very luxurious and again it does have that magnetic closure which i love next we have this one which the sticker kind of came a little you know it's a little there's a little bit of air in there but it does not take away from the actual smell of this product this one here is an aquatic peony it is inspired by giorgio armani aqua de giro i have everything on the screen some of these things i don't know how to say but basically it just smells so good i'd say this one is very light very feminine very like just floral that's what i get from this product i'm so glad that i chose this one and then florento coconut is very just like musk like it just smells so nice but it's not like fruity or like floral like the last one they're definitely very different from each other which i really enjoy but if i want to layer them i definitely could i've gotten a lot of compliments when i'm wearing these two perfumes they smell so nice they linger throughout the day it's just something that i've really been enjoying reaching for and i'm so glad that they reached out to me they're always adding new fragrances to their collection definitely check out their website there's going to be a code on the screen that you can use as you're checking out from their website and also there's going to be a link down below in the description box where you can click and go to their website so you can purchase a perfume of your own they're also always having sales on their site up to like 25 percent off they do have free exchanges as i mentioned and free returns so if you don't like something you could definitely return it and get something else so that's the great thing about this brand and i'm so glad that they reached out thank you so much to dossier for these two fragrances they smell amazing and i'm definitely going to keep reaching for them they're just so nice so yeah definitely so happy that they reached out and i'm glad that i finally got to try something from their website because these two are amazing i have to say if i had to choose one i say florento coconut is definitely my favorite but both of them are just so nice now let's get into the drugstore haul so first let's talk about dollar tree so i did pick up two of their beauty jars we have their april bath and shower four piece beauty jars so if you guys have been here i did start a project pan and i'm thinking if i ever have to depot something or like put something into 
into a smaller container these are really going to come in handy when that does happen it also comes with a little spatula which is really cool on the side as you can see so it does come with three jars and the little spatula i did go ahead and pick up two of these so i went ahead and picked up a different color in their powder oh this is a blush oh it says powder blush up here but it's a bronzer really weird but this is the LA Colors powder bronzer in the shade baked I believe I have a different shade in their bronzer so I did go ahead and pick this one up just to see and compare it does look like a deeper shade than the one that I already own so there's the shade baked oh my gosh I honestly think I might have this already in my collection if it does turn out that I have it in my collection I'll just give this away to my sister but oh it's like shimmery on the hand i may already own this i'm not sure because i remember i have something in the shade baked i'll have to see um but i don't know i guess i picked it up i thought it was a different shade i thought it was like a matte deeper kind of tone than the one that i already own but it seems to be the same bronzer that i already have so we'll see what i do with that i also went ahead and picked up two more products from ellie colors did i need them no but i did go ahead and pick this one up this is ellie colors highlight in shine bright i did used to own this but mine did shatter i believe i dropped it or i finished it something happened with it but i don't have this specific one in my like collection anymore so i did go ahead and pick up shine bright so there's a look at that highlight so nice it is a powder highlight i really love these Ugh yes this one's so nice i do have the more pinky tone one as well it's just so beautiful i had to pick it up again there is a swatch of shine bright it's definitely more of a golden kind of highlight so beautiful it goes on the skin so nicely for a dollar you can't beat it i also went ahead and picked up this bronzer also same situation i own some of their bronzers in this packaging but i believe this one's a deeper shade this one here is in bronze beauty there's a look at that bronzer so nice love the packaging that's bronze beauty i believe i have a lighter one so there it is at the top it is like a highlighty kind of situation we'll see what happens hopefully i don't already own this shade as well but i did go ahead and splurge a little bit i mean they're only a dollar i'm not bringing the bank or anything but hopefully i don't already own these products from the dollar tree um but you know we'll see we'll see what happens had and place an order on the color pop website i did also purchase from like the fourth ray line that they also have this is their fourth ray beauty coconut face milk compliments of emma fleming here on youtube she did a whole color pop haul i believe last sometime last year and i really wanted to try something from fourth ray beauty and a lot of their like skincare kind of stuff so a lot of people rave about them so i did want to try out their face milk and again this is the coconut one so I want to see what the fuss is all about. A lot of people like tend to love these products. So really wanted to see what it's all about. So this is what it looks like. I believe this is a mini size. This is a, again, coconut face milk. So cute. And it does come with a dropper. I definitely cannot wait to try. And it smells really nice. So I definitely can't wait to try this out. So cute. Such a cute little like travel size. Definitely can't wait to try this out on the skin and see what it's all about. So I went ahead and picked up their fourth rate beauty coconut body milk. So I picked up their face milk. I want to try out their body milk as well. I believe this one is a mini size. So there's a look at that. Again, something that a lot of people rave about is their body milk. So I definitely want to try this out. I believe it's like a lotion, but it looks kind of watery. So I'm not sure how to really use this, but we'll see. I'll definitely have to, okay. Apply daily to clean skin immediately after showering to lock in moisture and soften skin. Mix and match body milks for your skin needs. Oh, really interesting. Okay, I'm definitely going to update you guys on this product. And I also did purchase another fourth ray beauty product, which is their Hello Sunshine Brightening Primer Moisturizer. Another thing I cannot wait to try. It, smell, it, it smells. I haven't even smelled it. It just looks really interesting. Ooh, I hadn't opened this product. There's a look at that. It does come with a kind of squirt tube situation. So definitely cannot wait to try this out on the skin and see what it's all about. Next, I do have the ColourPop No Filter Setting Mist. Definitely another thing that Emma Fleming made me purchase. I love just how her makeup comes out all the time. And she tends to use a lot of ColourPop products this is again the no filter setting mist i did use this today i forgot to bring a setting spray with me thankfully i had these products next to me so i got to use this i felt like the mister was okay 
nothing to write home about and the smell was okay as well so i definitely want to keep trying this and see full thoughts on it because first impressions i was kind of like eh. um i'm glad that it was next to me and i got to spray my face with it because i forgot my setting spray but i thought this was fine nothing again to write home about so i was like kind of like mm. and lastly from ColourPop, i did pick up this product and this is their baroque eyeshadow palette or pressed pigment palette a pressed powder palette and this is definitely the one that called out to me it just looks so stunning i definitely wanted to try out more ColourPop palettes from their line and this is again just the one that every time somebody would use it in a video i wanted to pick up immediately and i just never bit the bullet so i just finally gave in went ahead and purchased it it just looks so stunning packaging wise but also the colors on the inside are just so beautiful so smoky and dark so nice so i definitely wanted to try this out and see what my thoughts are on these products i've seen so many people use this palette and it just looks stunning so i definitely cannot wait to try this out again there's some swatches of this palette it's so beautiful packaging wise but also color story goes so well with the packaging it's just cannot wait to use it lastly let's get into chamasse i have a couple repurchases i repurchased the aoe studio jelly jam lip mask in honey it's just my favorite one which is that yellow tone there these are amazing but i do go through them quite quickly because i use them at night time i have very dry lips so i love using these and these retail for 155 on their site and they come in various scents and colors and stuff so definitely check these out if you're into like a lip mask for nighttime or even throughout the day whenever you want to use them these are so nice and again they are repurchases there's a close-up look at that it's so cute i love these and these smell so nice as well i did go ahead and repurchase a couple of their hand creams so i did pick up the aoa studio shea butter hand creams in the lavender scent as well as the vanilla both of these are just as amazing they're really nice and creamy on the hands and they blend in so nicely these are perfect nice kind of like size as well to keep in my purse or in my fanny pack for work and stuff so i really love buying these because they're so nice and they also last me quite a while even though they're like a small kind of tube next i did go ahead and pick up the aoa studio scissor tweezers for one dollar these just look so nice and i've had so such great luck with their tools so i went ahead and purchased this product and i think this is going to be really helpful for when i'm applying my lashes as well so i definitely cannot wait to use this so there's a look at that product it looks really promising i went ahead and purchased this i don't know why i guess i wanted to try it out one more time which is the aoa studio xl long lasting shadow stick this one is in the shade matte night 224 and basically i've tried these out in different videos and i just don't love them so i don't know why i purchased this gray one i don't know if i wanted to give it one more chance to see what i thought or maybe i wanted no i think i read some comments where people were saying that they use them as eyeliners so i wanted to see if that works for me and this shade just looks so nice and it's going to go so well with the ColourPop palette if i use it as an eyeliner i think they're going to go really well together so there's a shade matte night 224 honestly it looks really promising when i use it on my channel i use it as an eyeshadow stick because it says it's a shadow stick so i use it on the eyes but it didn't really blend all that well so we're gonna see how it works as an eyeliner i picked up all of the aoa studio fairy garden palettes well these are a little hard to open this one here is in peony which is a more kind of orangey everyday palette this one here is in willow which comes with more green tones we have this one here in orchid really beautiful kind of pinky tones in here and lastly we have this one in lily which is really beautiful i love that kind of neon shade there it's so stunning and i purchased more of their nail polishes if you saw my other haul i purchased three i believe in a base coat um but i did go ahead and purchase a couple more colorful tones and these are just the aoa studio nail lacquers this one here is in brunch next we have this blue tone in the shade sweet treat this one here is in power move which is a more purple tone and then we have this red which is in the shade princess i've tried out their nail polishes again i did haul them the last time that i did this video or like a haul video and i love them they're amazing i am wearing one today the one that i have on the nails today is in the shade these are in pink slippers 
or something i'll have the name on the screen i don't really remember but these are just so stunning i love that color they have glitter ones they have matte ones they have clear coats they have everything for nail polishes so i'm definitely happy that i got to try or i am going to be able to try more colors in this line lastly for aoa studio or shamus a i have their spa gel gloves which are part of their a plus line and these retail for 188 so they're really heavy and basically you put them on your hand it says apply moisturizing cream or lotion slip on this gel glove for 20 to 30 minutes and then your hand is supposed to be softer smoother and healthier so i did pick up two of those and then i picked up two of their spa gel socks as well i just wanted to see how these work my thoughts on them and i'll definitely update you guys in future videos on these products and with that we made it to the end as i mentioned in the beginning of this video i'll have a link down below as well as my code for dossier down below go ahead and check them out pick up a fragrance for yourself or a family member or whatever they definitely have so many to choose from on their website so definitely don't forget that go into the description box click on the link and go purchase a fragrance for yourself so we made it to the end i hope you enjoyed watching as much as i know filming this video today everything that i talked about other names of the prices are going to be down below as well as any videos that i mentioned throughout this video or videos that i uploaded last week don't forget to upload three times a week on tuesday thursday and sunday so if you could stick around that would be amazing i have my insta handle displayed on the screen i post a lot of makeup finds from books that are high end so if that interests you go ahead and follow me there and it'd be so amazing if you could like and subscribe of course you don't have to you're your own person and make your own decisions but it wouldn't hurt to give this video a like and i'll see you guys in the next one bye